Hi, this is a uh, video for, to show how to set up a Wacker Noisen light balloon on a tripod, model LB1. Note, this video is for instruction purposes only. Always refer to your operator's manual when operating any kind of machinery. This is not a substitute for an operator's manual. As you can see, we have a tripod. We have the balloon carrying case. We have an aluminum or a PVC type carrying case. You have a ballast. You have, it comes with three uh, tie down wires, three stakes for the wires, and then all you, the only tool you need is a hammer to, to drive the stakes. So we're going to go ahead and set this up. It's about uh, 2.45 right now. So let's time how long it takes. very simple setup. We have a very unique balloon that's different than the other manufacturers. Pull the cord out. Pull the balloon out. This is a um, metal halide bulb, 1,000 watts. What's unique about the Wacker light balloon is that it does not have a fan. It does not require a filter for maintenance. It is a uh, patented uh, um, frame, internal frame with an umbrella type design. All you do is we have a little pin on the top here. You just pull this out of the way and turn it so it's out of the way. And then all you need to do to open this up is push it down. The internal frame expands the balloon. Twist the knob again to the reset position till it locks. We're locked. That's all there is. There's no fan. You have a very durable Kevlar top, a rip uh, resistant non-rip uh, um, diffuser on the bottom. It's held together with uh, Velcro, so it's very easy access to the bulb inside. Okay. So if you have to replace the bulb or tighten it, whatever, just open it up, push the Velcro back together again, you're ready to go. So now we have the balloon ready. Let's set up the tripod. Pick a level surface. That won't be in the traffic of uh, machinery. Open it up. You want the legs to be wide enough so that there's an angle on the tripod. You don't want it flat. Tighten it down. Note that one leg is adjustable, so if you do have uh, it, it's inclined, you can adjust one of the legs for keeping it level. Okay. We have the uh, little uh, hooks for the support uh, tie down wires. We'll hook those on right away. We have three of them in the kit. Do this now while, of course, while it's within reach.
Now we put the balloon on top. It has a uh, aluminum stub on the bottom and this stub is removable. It twists off and there's a threaded stud underneath it. Uh, we are developing an equipment mount kit so that will be useful uh, if you decide to thread it into a pole for an equipment mount kit. Tighten 